Hi guys, today i -re review ko itong Yves Saint Laurent Fusion Ink Cushion Foundation. Ito yung pinaka box niya and this contains 14 grams of product. Ito yung pinaka cushion and pagbukas mo, uh, ito yung puff niya, maganda, itim. Pero hindi ko siya ginamit for this review. Ang ginamit ko ulit yung bugbog na bugbog na face shop ko na uh, puff. Pag binuksan mo, again, meron siyang sticker and then yun yung pinaka product. It retails for 3,800 plus pesos. And nabili ko siya sa Singapore. And sabi dito sa papel na kasama dun sa box. The first travel-friendly foundation ink pot from YSL. Long-lasting perfection at first impression. The natural-looking result of a liquid foundation with the ease of use and practicality of a compact. Incredibly easy to achieve perfection. Flawless all-day coverage. This formula adapts to the specific needs of every woman to give a matte, light diffusing finish without a powdery effect in a simple step. Fresh hydration, all day comfort. Its fresh moisturizing texture becomes one with the skin for an instantly revived and ultra fresh feeling complexion. And rich with tamano oil, it hydrates the skin and boosts its luminosity while perfecting the look of the complexion every day. This action is reinforced by the applicator, which has been specially designed to apply just the right amount of product. Instant application on the go. Tailor-made application in a single step. Perfect coverage. Easy, effortless touch-ups, anytime, any place. Extraordinary synergy between the sponge ink pot, foundation, and applicator. In an instant, Fusion Ink Cushion Foundation delivers fresh hydration, perfect coverage, and a luminous matte finish for a natural looking result and great comfort all day long. I'm in the shade 40 and yung consistency niya, like yung usual lang na mga BB cushion, manipis lang. And it smells floral. The coverage is, to me, medium. Pero hindi enough to cover yung acne marks. So I use a separate concealer to cover my acne marks. I applied powder and nag-spray ako ng setting spray on top and the usual, hindi ako gumamit ng primer. Uh, maganda yung kapet or lapat sa kanya ng loose powder. As of now, may nakikita akong glow and hindi siya yung mat na mat. Para siyang yung soft mat, ganon. Meron siyang konting dewiness like yung sa ilong ko, dito sa cheeks. Skin-like finish. This BB cushion also feels light on the skin, para kang walang makeup.
gonna do, do, do we go? Maganda pa siya. Uh, medyo nag-start na siyang magkaroon ng texture dito sa yung parang laugh line tsaka dito sa chin. Um, yung forehead ko, kahit nakailang blat ako at tsaka yung, yung buong T-zone, hindi nabura yung foundation and walang masyadong sumasama na foundation dun sa may blatting sheet. And maganda pa siya. I think, aabot pa to ng 12 hours. Nabiblend siya eh. Pagka yung may mga uh, parang nagbubuo siya ng mga lines, ganon. So, blend lang, ganon. Maganda na siya ulit. Yung oil control niya maganda. And walang nag-cling sa any dry patches. So, sabi dito, flawless all-day coverage. Yes, flawless siya. And again, hindi siya basta nabubura. Fresh hydration, all-day comfort. Yes, and para kang walang gamit na foundation. Luminous matte finish. Yes, and dun pa rin yung mattified ka pero may glow ka. And skin-like siya. So, all in all, maganda siya. Yun lang, medyo hindi ko ganong gusto yung nagbubuo dito. Pero, dead man na. Kasi syempre, pag tinitingnan ko sa sarili ko yung salamin, ganyan kalapit. I mean, hindi na siya masyadong, hindi na siya masyadong halata. And naabot pa siya ng 12 hours. I think kung hindi ka nga oily combination or oily, let's say, nasa normal skin type ka, baka umabot pa ng longer than that. So, that's it. I hope you learned something today, something helpful, and thank you for watching. Bye!